Video showing a couple celebrating a birthday being beaten and tased by police. They are now filing a civil rights lawsuit against the city of San Jose, California over their treatment. ABC's Zareen Shaw joins us with more. Good morning, Zareen. Good morning, Eva. A year later, the couple says they still have scars on their body after they say they were beaten by police. Meanwhile, the city attorney is pushing back on their claims. San Jose Police. According to a federal civil rights lawsuit filed against the city of San Jose and the officers involved, it was a police response to a noise complaint that quickly spiraled out of control. In body camera footage obtained exclusively by ABC station KGO, San Jose police officers are seen arriving at a hotel where Marissa Santa Cruz and Paya Tikawafu were spending her 22nd birthday. The couple says police told them the hotel would allow them to stay after they turned the music down following a noise complaint before 9 p.m. Do you have any ID on you by any chance? Then an officer is heard asking for ID. We got ID, everybody that we come in contact with. Yeah, how we do. Backup officers arrive. Paella asks for his ID back. No, not right now. That's when one officer says they needed to leave. The agreement was that you would not violate the policies here. You slam the door in our face. Marissa and Paella start packing while an officer is told to get a riot gun. I have uh, 40 mil. Go grab one yep. A sergeant urges the couple to pack faster. I'm asking you guys to hurry it up. Then he encourages his team to use force. Push up and tase this guy. Marissa is seen trying to intervene. According to the complaint, Paya got stunned, shot with a riot gun, and struck multiple times with batons. He says he still has this red welt from the riot gun and that Marissa was hit by batons and shot by projectiles, left with deep contusions. If this is how the San Jose Police Department handles a noise complaint, you cannot imagine how they will handle severe or more serious, like, criminal offenses. The couple is hoping for change within the entire force. I want them to, 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 to look at this and be like, oh, if it's something as simple as that, we'll, we'll handle it just as what it is. The police department and city did not reply to on-camera requests, but the San Jose Police Department's newly appointed city attorney's office filed answer, saying the couple was combative and reached for a taser, saying each use of force was an appropriate, reasonable, and constitutionally permissible response to plaintiff's actions under the circumstances. Dan? The story landing at a time when America is having a deep discussion about the role of policing. Zoreen, thank you very much. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.